Hi, I'm just here to walk you through some things from week 15 that seem to be a little confusing for some. Um, so let's head down to week 15. Um, I think part of the confusion uh, in the questions that I'm getting is not looking at what's here very carefully, because I think if you do look at it, you'll see um, the exams are located in the exam module, and there are two of them, okay? Then there's a link. This is a link to completing your student evaluations. So it, the students who are emailing me saying, what do you mean by the student evaluation? <laughs> I need you to click on this link. Um, and then there's the upload um, where you, when you finish this, you get a confirmation screen that shows that you've completed your evaluation. So you just take a screenshot of that and upload it here in this quiz. There's also a link to virtual advising and then upload your confirmation um, of your summer registration. This, this one is optional, but this one is required. Um, I am requiring all students to complete their student evaluations. Um, so uh, you get a quiz grade for this, a zero if you don't do it, a 10 if you do. And uh, this is the link to take you to those student evaluations. When you click on the link, it takes you directly to the student evaluations and the instructions for logging in are right here in front. Okay, um, so make sure that you are, again, going to the week 15 materials, otherwise it is a bit baffling. Okay, so here in the exams, you have two exams. You have the final exam, which needs to be taken via ProctorU, and you have your revised research essay final exam, which is required. Um, so here you upload a copy of your revised research essay. Um, your research essay was originally in week 11, but the best way to get to it is through um, the gradebook, and you're looking for that argument essay with research, the final draft of the argument essay with research, which came in in week 11. Again, you can go to it through week 11, or you can go to the gradebook and look for the week 11 major assignment. Please make sure you look at the feedback um, before you turn in um, that revised research essay final exam. It is a final exam, and if you got a C on that research essay, or even lower, or even a B, you have the opportunity to improve that grade here and in the week 11 grade, because if I see that you've made those improvements here, I will put the higher grade here and in the week 11 assignment as well. So, Please make sure you look at the feedback. There's feedback um, beside your assignment. There's also a rubric to let you know where in the rubric you might have struggled. Um, and there's also comments embedded within the piece, um, within the essay in some cases. So uh, take a look at all that feedback and make sure you're really engaging with it and improving the things that need to be improved. If I don't see improvements, I'm not just going to raise the grade just because you turned it in again. So make sure that you do engage with that feedback. Um, the final exam um, has a due date. It says the 6th, but the last window to take that, I believe, is the 5th, and that was in your announcements. Please don't forget to look in your announcements, um, and that is in the Proctor U sign-up information. Um, it's also in the Week 14 Essentials. Um, it's also in the Week 15 information. Um, so please make sure that you're engaging with these announcements as well, okay? Um, so if you have any remaining questions, do please reach out and let me know.